How's it going, everybody? Raising Hell here, and today I'm going to show you how to disable the intro logos in Civilization VI. As you're aware, when you um, first launch Civilization VI, it's going to play both the 2K and the Firaxis logo before actually showing the main menu. And I'm going to show you how to get around doing this. Okay, so the idea here is that we're going to replace the original logos.bk2 file with a blank one. So I have a blank one here prepared and I'm going to copy it. Well, first I'm going to back up this original one. So what I'm going to just do is rename it to something that is obviously not going to be looked for by the game, say BK uh, original. Now that should not cause any problems with the game and yet it allows you to revert back to it if you so desire. Secondly, I have the new BK2 file right over here. A copy it it's a very small file it's six kilobytes and it will be linked in the description for you to download so we're just going to replace that file in the destination and now let's go ahead and try relaunching civilization six there we go as you can see we jumped right to that menu now obviously the downside of this of course is that you sort of lose your entire background of the main menu so if you appreciated that if you like the little map with the globe kind of spinning around then this is probably not for you but as far as I'm aware this is the only way to actually be able to replace the 2k and the Firaxis logo and while it is possible that in the future somebody might take the effort to pick the other one apart and recompile uh, the the actual main menu stuff without the logo it is quite unlikely if you compare the two sizes of the files let's just exit the desktop here if you compare the uh, size of the original it is 79 almost you no know, it almost rounded up to 80 megabytes versus the new logo which is only 5.6 kilobytes so obviously you're going to be there was a lot of data in that file uh, but is you know providing you don't really care about the main menu background being animated and whatnot uh, it works just fine and this way you know especially for people who have to relaunch the game a lot for modding or whatnot balancing testing that kind of stuff like me i tend to load a lot of mods on it and then test them out so those precious few seconds that are being sh shaved off by disabling the logos more than compensates for the lack of a main menu background in my opinion so that covers how to disable the introduction logo in Civilization VI for people on Windows machines. There will be printed instructions for all of this that I demonstrated here in the video in the description, as well as for people who are using Mac OS machines. The logo BK2 file will also be linked so you can download it and replace yours. But you know, remember to back up your original just, just in case you ever want to revert to it. It's always a smart way to go about uh, modding things, right? Thank you very much for watching, and I hope to see you next time.